Hello, I'm Chris Menard. In today's Microsoft Word video, I'm going to show you how to easily move pages around in your document. So I've got three items to cover. Let's go ahead and dive into this video. So item number one that I'd like to cover is what people ask me all the time that they think should work, but it doesn't. So here it is up on the view tab. Turn on the navigation pane under the show group. And here's pages. It is a word file. It is not Acrobat or Adobe Acrobat. So you can't just drag and drop pages around. That is what will not work just to cover that one. But what does work, I don't know if you caught my video recently on how to use style headings in Word, but just a quick review. I'm not going to go all the way through here. <clears throat> I've got different states listed, Florida, Georgia. Within each state, we have counties. And then within each county, you have cities. So there's a drill down. So Florida is a state, so it's a heading one. Miami-Dade County is a heading two. And then under that county are the cities, Miami, Surfside. And then I just threw in another county. So Surfside and Miami are heading three. So I've got heading one, heading two, heading three. And just to show you this, keep going down. We hit another state where I live, Georgia, counties again. Keep on going. So if you go and pull up the navigation pane, view, navigation pane, there are my headings over here. Cool. So what I can do is if I want Georgia to be before Florida, just click, drag and drop. Now Georgia's at the very beginning of the document. I'm going to do this again. If I want Broward County to be ahead of Miami-Dade County, click, just drag and drop. And then I could even swap cities just to show you this. That is the easy way to do stuff, but you've got to have heading styles in your document. If you have a long document, you should have headings anyway, by the way. But let me cover it if you don't have any headings. So let me swap files. Same Word document I just had, except there are no heading styles. Everything is normal style or normal text. So here I go again, Miami and here we go, Fort Lauderdale and Hollywood. Both are cities, highlight and copy, and then you can just cut, control X. Where do you want to put it? Control V. That's one way. Another way to do it is you could select and then drag and drop, but that, that's only handy if you don't have far to drag and drop, to be honest with you. Cool tip that I do want to share with you. What if you have just a lot of text to select? So here I go. I'm going to hit Florida. That's my insertion point that's flashing. If you want to call it the cursor, that works for me. Scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. There's the next state. I'm holding down the shift key and I'm going to left click. That's selected from where my insertion point was down to where I held shift and click. Control X. Go to the end of the document or wherever you want to put it. Control V. Uh, I prefer the style method, but this is how you can quickly just select text and move it around. So I hope that helps with moving pages and at least you know that you can't go to the navigation view pages and just drag them around. That doesn't work. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you have any comments or questions, please put them down below. Thank you for your time.